I'm Karen Eba and welcome back to Holo Holo, America's top entertainment and lifestyle show for Asian Pacific Americans. And it's time now for our K-pop monthly segment with our LA18 entertainment insider, Cindy J. Lee. Welcome back, Cindy. Hey, Kat. <laughs> How's it going? Good. Great to be here. <laughs> yes, and I know you have a ton of news for us, especially for the lady groups, right? Yes. K-pop ladies. But let's start with Sai. Yes. Sai is coming back. Okay. I'm so excited. <laughs> yes, so after months and months of teasing, of According to Star News in Korea, Sai is coming back in April. Ooh, it's about yes. time because you keep teasing us, right? Yes, exactly. Well, he keeps teasing yeah, he us. He keeps teasing <laughs> us with like photos with Snoop Dogg, oh. and um, we are very excited since he became a worldwide star with <laughs> Gangnam Style back in 2012, July. You know, he released Gentleman, yeah. and that became a hit. And then after that, you know, we haven't heard much from him. Mm -hmm. And now he's coming out with not only one song, but several songs. Ooh. And there's going to be a new dance. We are <laughs> looking forward to that, the new dance. Yes, and I can't wait to hear more about it. But for now, let's talk about the ladies, because I know they're also doing comebacks. Yes. Um, so crayon pop, remember uh -huh. crayon pop? Yes. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> well, here they call it bar bar bar. Again, right. I don't like that. Just call it ba ba ba. At least try. Right. But, <laughs> so um, they've been compared. Their dance, the five cylinder engine dance, has been compared to Gangnam Style because right. it's very unique. And remember, last time I came here, they said that they're getting rid of the helmets. Mm -hmm. They're gonna get rid of the helmets, and we were worried. Oh no, are they gonna turn all soul sexy. sexy and like you know like uh, don't change your look. Yeah, don't yeah. change. Don't change what's unique about you. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, you know they just tease um, tease us with a new image, mm -hmm. and they're wearing bandanas. Oh, red bandanas, <laughs> and, and it's like it's not that far off from helmet. Right. So it's, it's, it's similar. Not. It's very okay. Unique. They're all wearing bandanas. <laughs> they're looking fierce, and also their clothes. Do you know what a hanbok is? Yes, the, the Korean, Korean traditional, traditional costume. Thing. So they kind of modified it. Oh. And they crayon popified it. Yes. <laughs> I like and that. They made it really cute, mm -hmm. and um, I'm really looking forward to their new song, which is coming out on April 1st, right. April Fool's Day. <laughs> but it is true, they're coming out with yeah, a new yes, song, right? Yeah, unless on that day they say just kidding or okay. something like that. But I'm again, I'm not even sure that Koreans know what April Fool's Day is, so hopefully <laughs> they are coming out with a new song called mm -hmm. uh, e. Uh, e. And yeah, it's coming out on April 1st, so mm -hmm. look forward to that. Nice, and then they're also, they have some huge news, Lady Gaga and um, Crayon Pop. Yes, <laughs> so Crayon, Lady Gaga tweeted several days ago that Crayon Pop will be opening for her shows in wow. June and July for her Art Rave the Art Pop Ball tour. Mm -hmm. So I'm really excited about that. And you know, Lady Gaga is a huge fan of K-pop. Yeah. We'll talk more about that later, okay. but <laughs> yes, she is a huge fan of K-pop. Uh -huh. And um, I know she's probably like looked around, like who's, who's good? Who's good for my who's opening good? show? And she, they, she chose Crayon Pop yeah. and they look good together. You yeah. know, they're both unique, so I'm really happy about that. Yeah, they have their own style, their own look to it. But exactly. um, also another group that I really like is Girls' Generation. Yes. Girls' Generation just came back with their new, um, their fourth mini album, Mr. Mr. Mm -hmm. And I'm loving it because, uh, you know, Girls' Generation always had that innocent look. Their, their color is pink, by the way. Every group kind of has their own color. They're, oh, okay. they're their fans. Um, they always like hold pink balloons, pink <laughs> lights during their concert. So when I think of Girls' Generation, I think pink. Mm -hmm. Fairly cute, innocent. In Mr. Mr., they show more of a soul. Side, yes, sexier, sexier you side. know, the lipstick's darker, yeah. the eyeliner is a little darker, <laughs> and uh, you know, I like it because uh, you see a different side of them, and even the songs are, you know, darker, sexier, more mature, more mature maybe. Exactly. <laughs> and they're also crossing over to the states. They were on live with Kelly. Yeah. Well, um, when they came out with their last album, they came out to the states to promote, right. and they were on live with Kelly mm -hmm. on the David Letterman show. And for the first ever YouTube Music Awards, they won the yeah. huge award, which was Music Video of the Year. Yeah, and they beat out like Miley, Miley and Spurs, Lady Gaga. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So I was thinking, you know, um, we're, I'm very excited that Crayon Pop's opening for Lady Gaga. <laughs> but maybe in a few years, Lady Gaga will be opening for Girls' Generation or Crayon Pop or any other K-pop group. Maybe it'll be the other way around. Yeah. Because K-pop is getting <laughs> becoming huge. Everywhere. So, exactly. <laughs> to, um, to anyone. Did I say that right? To yeah. anyone? To anyone. <laughs> Anyone? <laughs> I like their new song, Come Back Home. Yes. Um, 21 also came back with their new album, Crush. Uh -huh. And oh my gosh, they are one of my favorite Me too. girl groups. <laughs> they're, they're edgier, they're different, they're not, they're completely different from Girls' Generation. Yeah. And they came out with Crush like a week after Girls' Generation came out mm -hmm. with Mr. Mr. 
and people are like, ooh, fierce competition. <laughs> Who's going to top the charts? And I was thinking, why even compare the two? Yeah, they're, they're completely, completely different. different. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 21, um, you, you know, I think of them more like Rihanna and girls' generations like Taylor Swift. Okay, so, so you like, can't we wouldn't really, really compare, compare them. It's completely different. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, but I, I can say, you know, I love Come Back Home, mm -hmm. just as you do. Yeah. And uh, th that song is number two on the K-pop Billboard oh, 100 wow. chart right now. That's good. Yes, but um, Girls' Generation is number four with Mr. Mister. <laughs> so it's you know, similar. There is a fierce yeah, competition. There is fierce competition, but again, I wouldn't really compare the two. Yeah. But, okay, yeah. last group. Really Really quickly, four minute. <laughs> four minute. Yes. As you all know, four minute is the group with Hyuna, mm -hmm. who was in the Gangnam Style music video. Yeah. Uh, yes. So uh, four minute came out with their new mini album, Four Minute World, mm -hmm. and their song What You Doing Today is become a huge hit. Uh -huh. And you saw the music video, yes, right? I did. A lot of uh, what do we call it? twerking, twerking going on, booty really shaking. Well, <laughs> yeah. uh, I like. It's just a fun song, you okay. know. Onemohe, <laughs> itamohe. You know. Yeah. It's just really cute, yes. and that became an overnight, overnight. hit. Yeah. It, it's, it topped all the charts in Korea, and it's probably gonna climb its way through to the Billboard charts as well. Okay. So, and Hyuna, after appearing in the Gangnam Style oh music God, video, yeah. she also became kind of an international star, mm -hmm. and she, you know, came out with a solo album. Yeah, she performed at South by South Southwest. South Southwest, exactly. Yeah. And Lady Gaga visited oh the K-pop night, where um, she and um, Jay Park performed, and um, you know, there's a cute video out where um, Hyuna is performing Bubble Pop. One right. of her singles, and then Lady Gaga like dancing along to it. So yeah, Hyuna um, and and Four Minute as well. I'm really excited about that. We can't wait for more from them, and I'm sure maybe they'll be touring with Lady Gaga soon. <laughs> yes. Thank you so much, Cindy. Always a pleasure to get all the K-pop news from you. No problem. It's great to be here. <laughs> Time for a quick break, but we have more from Hollow Hollow when we return.